Yo, what's up? My name is Mike Ford. I'm also known as the Hip Hop Architect. My name is Mike Dando. Uh, I am an educational researcher uh, and PhD candidate at the University of Wisconsin-Madison. My name is Rob Franklin, also known uh, in musician terms as the artist Rob Dees. All right, so what is hip-hop architecture? You get asked that question all the time. So I look at hip-hop architecture as achieving two different goals. One, increasing the number of minorities involved in architecture. The second goal is retelling the history of architecture and urban planning as it relates to black communities. One of the core components of hip hop, uh, the hood, the block, the community, you don't have hip hop without, without that. And, and it's more than just it's a place, a physical, geographical location. It's about the people there, investing in their community, creating their own vision, um, literally making something out of nothing. If you look at hip hop, the lyrics, the aesthetics, it tells us what happened in our communities. It gives an unfiltered history of bad urban planning and bad architecture. So hip hop architecture is a way not only to get kids involved, but to make architecture aware of the injustices that have been placed on communities of color through what many might consider to be good design or good intended design, but it had a very bad effect on our community. The goal for us is not only to get more students of color invested in those careers, but also to kind of reimagine themselves. I currently work with the library, the Madison Public Library, and I would kind of be the hip hop involved in the hip hop architecture camp. You have a responsibility to rap about more than just the average everyday stuff. You have to be able to talk about, you know, the structural process and building up our communities. Getting these kids to see it and then to be able to be the sages of their community and be able to share it with others so that the idea of building and not only building structure-wise, but building ourselves as individuals up through different, through different platforms and different ideas. So the Hip Hop Architecture Camp is a four-day camp that introduces kids to architecture. The camp is based off of hip-hop lyrics that usually describe our environment and tells us what's going on in our communities. So the kids are able to listen to lyrics and then create their own environment, their own community, and the spaces that they want to see based on a music culture. We're tapping into the genius that our kids and our community have um, to build something, well, to build a future, to reimagine and revision what our worlds can look like. Instead of me showing kids hip hop architecture, I'm allowing kids to create their own version of architecture that's based on hip hop. This particular instance in the Hip Hop Architecture Camp, what we're doing is taking suggestions from the city planning sessions and the actual building sessions and transforming that into, into a song, into an anthem, centered around the idea of building it up. And we're going to put together a track produced by DLO, um, Bradley Thomas, and we're going to have all of our kids that are participating in this camp write on their experiences and in turn put that into an anthem that can be shown to kids all across the country. So the Hip Hop Architecture Camp allows youth who will be the future, who are our future, to define the spaces that they want to see 20 years from now. And the kids are just, just tremendous. They're inspiring us almost as much um, as you know, the greatest hip hop DJs or, or hip hop artists ever. I believe the children are the future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. I'm just kidding, that's what yeah. we use them. Yo, so I'm Mike Ford, and I just want to tell everybody go ahead and build it up. This is Mike Danner from the University of Wisconsin Madison, just encouraging y'all to build it up. Yo, what up? This is Rob Dees here from the Hip Hop Architecture Camp telling y'all, man, it's time to build it up.